In this screencast, we're going to talk about site usability. And I'm going to guide you through a US government website called usability.gov to learn about web usability. Let me just pull up the page for you. And the URL is www.usability.gov. And let's just start with the basics. You can see here that there is a usability basics link. Let's click into it. If you don't know what web usability is, you can start from this page. It answers most of the basic questions about web usability. And let's just look at the first two questions. What is usability and why is usability important? And feel free to pause this video at any time to read through some of these texts or you can pull up a browser and load this page and follow along. Let's go to the second question. And let's go back to the main page. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk you through these four steps that's at the top of the website. The first one is the plan tab. This section helps you understand the, ba the planning aspects of creating a highly usable site. It is strongly recommended to plan before you start, but how much planning is required is based on the site designer, which is yourself. So remember to save this page in your bookmark for future reference. Then you have the Analyze tab. If you already have a site created and would like to reanalyze your existing site, you can go through the topics introduced in this section. Then you have the Design tab. This section provides very useful information about designing a prototype from your usability plan. As you can see on this page, it has a lot of brain-teasing questions to help you think towards creating a website that has a high usability. These are highly valuable questions and it's imperative that you try to answer as many of these questions as possible. Then there's this last tab called Test and Refine. This section provides good information about testing and refining your website. Once you have a site created, you're recommended to test early and test often, as stated here. Okay, let me scroll down for you to look at. Last thing I want to show in this screencast is the visual visual overflow of the uh, usability process flowchart. You can have this flowchart as a guide when you're creating your website, and it's right here. The good thing about this image or this map here is that if you mouse over each of these boxes it takes you uh, if you click on it it takes you to that certain topic within the site and that's it for this screencast thank you